Last night, Spencer Dinwiddie hit one of the biggest shots of his career against the Celtics to win the game. Celtics are there. Kick out Dinwiddie for three. It's good. And the Mavs take the lane with nine seconds to go. I wasn't surprised at all, though, since he showed in the past he can hit big shots. It's fires. Oh, Spencer Dinwiddie delivers a three. Get it in for Dinwiddie. Defended by Brogdon. Six seconds. Dinwiddie fades away. Oh, Dinwiddie. And it goes to Dinwiddie. Dinwiddie goes to work. Long two. The Cavs are out of timeouts. But after the game, he made sure to let the Wizards know they made a mistake letting him go. Your work environment can kind of be like dating sometimes, right? Like, you want the person that wants you. Um, simple as that, right? Like, at the end of the day, you know, you, you want to be able to have peace in your work environment. You want somebody to, to want you and, and let you be you. He's definitely right about that. If you're in the wrong environment, that could really affect your play. As a player, all you want is a team that wants you and is confident in your abilities. Because he's in the right situation, he's arguably playing his best basketball. Right now with the Mavs, he's averaging nearly 18 points and 4.5 and assists, shooting 50% from the field and 44% from three. That's a big difference from how he was playing with the Wizards. The Mavs also been winning. With him playing this season, they're not in two. The league better not sleep on the Mavs because they low-key got a squad right now. Teams should low-key be scared to play them. They've been one of the most resilient teams. After they win against the Celtics, they now lead the league in double-digit comebacks. I won't want to see a team like that in the playoffs. So I have a feeling Luka's finally going to get past the first round this season. They might even surprise people and go to the Western Conference Finals. Who knows? The way Luka been playing lately and the way this team is assembled, I think that's possible. But how far do y'all think the map is going to go? Let me know in the comments. And if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe for more vids. Peace.